Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create NFT chest animation with Element 3D in After Effects. Let's get started. So after this video, I will add download link and project files. Let's create new solid layer for Element 3D. Right mouse, new and solid. Add name Element 3D. Click OK. Then go to FX, Video Copilot and Element. Let's click Scene Setup for open Element 3D interface and click Import button. Let's open our 3D folder and select this chess model. Click Open. Then click OK and click Scale tool. Let's scale our object. OK, click Move tool and move to up. Then go to click this icon and let's enable show ambient occlusion. Let's go to open chest and select this texture and go to diffuse. Let's click non set and click lower texture. Let's open our folder and textures. Open folder one and select this chest one base. Click open. Nice. Click OK. Then go to normal bump. Click load textures and let's import normal map. Click open, click OK. Nice. Let's change this 300. OK, nice. Then select this M chest button and go to diffuse. Click non set, load textures, and let's back to folder. Open folder 2 and select chest to base, click open, click OK. Go to normal bump, click non set, load texture, select normal map, click open and OK. Let's change here 300, nice. So in this time let's select this chest and let's control D for duplicate. Let's open chest, change name chest one and this chest two let's open chest one and select this chest button let's click checkbox for height then open chest two and select this chest top and click this checkbox for height okay let's see nice so let's select this chest one and click this icon axis look and let's move to left okay and move to up and enable chest 2 and click this icon go to select rotate icon and let's see okay good very nice so Let's hide chest 1 and go to import, open Bitcoin folder, select Bitcoin model, click open, click OK. Let's click move tool and move to up, select rotate tool and let's rotate object and like this, click scale tool, change scale. So let's go to preset and open physical folder. Let's use gold material. Let's use here. Okay. And let's use bright light for this text. And for this. For this. Okay, and for background, use again gold material. Let's Go to sim materials and use this gold for this background nice so click this environment icon for see background hdr image and let's enable chest one okay let's hide again go to preset go to environment folder backlight environments backlight 2k let's try use this environment images okay let's try change this color to black go to materials and physical 
let's use black metro okay not bad okay and let's select this bitcoin and change aux channel channel 2 and select this chess 1 let's click checkbox and select this chess 1 let's change aux channel 1 okay good so let's click ok and let's make a little animation for these objects first step create camera right mouse new and camera click ok and for use camera with shortcuts press c in the keyboard or we can change controllers with these icons i will use c in the keyboard okay let's move to here so select this element 3d solid layer and go to group one and let's open out channels select this channel one open rotation let's try change rotate like this okay good so let's make rotation keyframe and select this element 3d press u for c keyframes and let's move to here go to here and go to 10 keyframe for shortcut you can use hold shift press page down in the keyboard and let's change rotation like this okay and go to 10 keyframe again let's change like this go to 10 keyframe again okay let's select keyframes make easy select keyframes go to graph editor and let's select this graph make like this okay select last keyframes move to right okay good so let's close channel one and open channel two and go to here let's make new keyframe and press u for c keyframes here and let's move to down okay and make scale keyframe let's press u again for c new keyframes and change scale zero then go to here and change scale one and let's move to up select keyframes make easy let's see okay select keyframes and let's move to left okay so select the sketch keyframe let's move to left okay select keyframes move to right and move to right this keyframe okay nice let's select keyframes and move to left okay select this first shape frame let's try to move to down okay this good let's move to down again nice and go to here select this shape frame go to graph editor select this graph let's make like this let's move to right okay and let's go to last keyframe and go to 10 keyframe let's move to down again go to 10 keyframe move to up again go to 10 keyframe move to down again go to 10 keyframe move to up and again let's see okay select this last keyframes and hold alt move to right for slow animation let's see okay this good so let's make rotate keyframes and let's open rotation let's try this okay let's go to here and make rotation keyframe press u for see new keyframes here and let's move to right 
chain rotation like this. Let's see. Okay. Let's change this minus 90. Okay, let's change minus 25. Okay, and let's change this last shape frame like this. Okay, and go to here, change again like this. Select shape frames, make easy. And let's go to here. Go to last shape frame chain rotation again and select these last three key frames control c control v again control v okay let's see okay let's select these key frames hold alt move to right and select these key frames hold alt move to right let's say again So let's select this element 3D, go to scene setup and go to create, select plane, click scale tool and let's scale like this. Okay and let's use black glass for this plane and click selection tool, select this plane and go to click this icon, reflect mode and change mirror surface okay good let's click this icon and close grid okay let's open plane mode select this black glass change this glossiness like this okay good then go to environment and i will use this light or this okay click ok nice and let's close aux channel and open render settings and open lighting open additional lighting and let's open rotation chain rotation like this okay this is good and open ambient occlusion click checkbox and change intensity 10 then press C for change camera view like this. Let's see. Okay, nice. Let's select this camera, right mouse and go to camera, create orbit null and press air. Let's change camera view like this and make year rotation. Go to here and change rotation like this. Go to first second. Hold shift press P, make new passing key frame and move to right and go to here. Let's move to like this and change rotation. Okay, let's try change rotation like this and Okay, select these last shape frames. Let's move to here. Let's see. Okay, let's move to right here. Okay, good. Let's try chain rotation like this. So nice. Let's say camera, open camera options, click depot field on and let's change aperture 100, click blur lever 300 and let's change focus distance. Let's see. Okay, this is good. Let's go to here and change blur lever like this and aperture 
Okay, so let's make focus distance keyframe and let's change distance like this. Okay. And go to here in this time, change distance like this. And go to here, change distance like this. Change again. Okay, good. And let's try change aperture like this. 200. Okay, not bad. So let's try change Bitcoin material. Select this element 3D. Go to scene setup and let's open bitcoin here go to physical and let's use this black glass for this background and let's use gold text okay not bad click ok let's see Okay, this is not bad. Let's go to scene setup again. Enable chess one. And go to environment. Let's use better HDR image. Okay, this is not bad. Backlight. Click OK. Okay, this is good. I liked so for motion blur let's click toggle switch mode and select this element la layer and click this motion blur icon okay good so thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck